can't stand the hypocrisy of it all. So, people coming up to us and shaking our hands and offering us their condolences. And then why? It was our dad. None of these have even seen him in years. What is your problem? If they want to come up and offer the sympathies, why have you got a problem with that? Trust that to piss you off. Do you know what I should have done? I should have made like a, a coffin cake. Do you know what I mean? A slice of death cake, Mary. To chase it down with your three egg mayo woodies and four helping to key sheep. Your voice down. No, oh, no, I'm sad. It's alright. I'll just sit here and pretend like any of them lot out there give a shit about our dad while he's still here. You wouldn't want to see them anyway. I mean, ever since mum died, them lot, they've hardly visited or even called them. But now look at them. Jesus. Oh, queuing up for the free hot food. Mm. How about you all start a conga line, eh? Make this a proper send off. And where were you lot when it mattered, eh? And where were you? Sorry, what? Where were you? I was here. You know, when it could be. I just. I had stuff on work and that, like, you know. Because I was there. I was the one dressing him, undressing him, washing him, taking him to the toilet when he soiled himself, rolling him on his side so he'd choke on his own vomit, holding him at night when he was hallucinating and calling out for mum. But not you. Okay? So just shut up and go fucking mingle. I was scared. I was scared of seeing him like that. So was I. What was I supposed to do? I'm grateful for everything you do. All I want to do is get through today. So that means smiling and nodding and watching that lot get off on some free sausage rolls. So be it. I'm so tired.